Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Chief News. Today is the 27th day of June, 2021. You guys can see from my screen, we are going to give you all a price prediction update into the market for Matic. You guys can tell that the downtrend is still in play for this cryptocurrency. That is one thing that we need to make sure that we talk about on this particular video and our expectation as to where price is going to go. So before I go into all of that, before I break down what happened since our last video, make sure you hit that like button, share and subscribe here to our channel. If you want to become part of our community, it's just that simple. It is our premise within our community to make sure that we get in position and win and dominate in this cryptocurrency space. If you're all about that, come on board. If you're not and you just want to be entertained, you have a lot of other places you can go. But for us, we focus in on the price so that we can win and take the bag back from the trap. So let's go ahead and get started in this prediction for Matic right here <clears throat> real quick. First, last time we did our price prediction in Matic was right here on June the 19th. So let me zoom in and show you all what happened since that particular time. Right. We've been playing the weakness into the market in Matic. And that is precisely what the price has done. It's been trending lower. It's been getting weaker and weaker and weaker. So we're not surprised though, right? Everyone else is running around trying to question what is going on. Why isn't the cryptocurrency space going high in price? Is this now the opportunity to come through and buy Matic? Well, you guys can see that it wasn't the time to buy it. The price continues to go lower and lower and lower. As a matter of fact, you could have gotten 13.83% out the market within two days of us during our prediction. If you want to take it out right now, you have about 24 and a half percent right there. It's just that easy. It is just that simple. Don't listen to anyone that is making this so complicated that you have no idea what they're talking about. So now question is we're in a downtrend. Okay. So don't let no one try to fool you. Don't let no one try to hype you up into buying this currency. When in fact, you can see that Matic is in a downtrend, right? So why would you come through the market and buy something that is still trending lower? Okay. There is this mantra. There is this hashtag going on on Twitter. Every time you see a massive dump, like 20% double digit losses moving to the downside, they tell you to buy the dip. Now, listen, imagine all the people who took that and bought the dip and Matic when it went down here, right? When it came down here to a dollar sixty, buy the dip, buy the dip. Okay, cool. You did. You bought the dip at a dollar sixty. But then you see again in June, buy the dip, buy the dip. Okay, so you bought at a dollar twenty. Market moves higher. Now you're coming all the way back down here towards a dollar. Buy the dip. Buy the dip. I guess they think that you have a, a money print that's in around your spot and you can just print up money and just buy these cryptocurrencies at will, right? You don't buy the dip. You only buy when the market finds a bottom, okay? Whenever the market finds a bottom, that's when you come through and buy. And we haven't found that yet. The trap hasn't made his determination that the bottom is in yet. Be careful about the information that you guys are getting because people are not worried about your well-being. They're just not. They're just worried about getting the clicks and they're just worried about getting the views so that they can seem important and valuable in this community. You need someone in your corner that doesn't care whether or not the market's going to go higher, whether it's going to go lower. You can profit either way it goes. So everything is not always a buy. It's just not. And you guys should see that, especially Matic following May 19th, May 18th, price is still going lower. Okay. So I'm going to keep it real with you. You can see that Matic, do you think we're in an uptrend though in the long term? So let me show you this line here real quick. So I'm going to take a line here, prop it right there because this is where the market came through and bounced off that support area. Okay. So. Let me move this out the way. I don't want to confuse nobody here on our team. So now this is the trend right here. This is the trend that Matic was actually following. Tell me what happened recently. We broke that trend to the downside. That's negative. For anyone who's looking for the price to go higher in Matic, that is a negative thing to see. Okay, that's one. So now let me take this line and move it here. Okay. 
could this be the trend? Because currently, this is how the actual massive up move has trended in Matic, right? <clears throat> so looking at this, you guys can tell that we have a ways to go before we actually come and test this line from where price is right now in Matic. Let's see how far that is. So that is about another 50% drop in price in Matic, right? So why would you come through and buy the dip if that is something that could possibly occur in the future in Matic? You could get this cryptocurrency at cheaper prices. It just hasn't came that low yet, right? So let's get rid of all this. So what I'm actually trying to show you is that the market weakness in Matic can still go a lot lower. So if anyone tells you to buy these dips, tell them to prove to you where the market dip is. Where is the market stopping point from going lower? Where is it found at? Because looking at those descending lines that I've just drawn, we got a ways to go to the downside in Matic so far. And that's looking at this from a weekly to a monthly perspective, right? And what I'm seeing right now to the market in Matic, this is where I'm seeing a temporary area of support. Okay, one is there around 94 cents. Then the next one is going to be down here towards 72 cents. So 94, 72. Keep those numbers in mind as this particular market in Matic continues to trade. Now, one reason why we are still suspecting that weakness is still on the table for Matic is because this market broke this support area as well, right? The market in Matic was holding this line on these two three-day price bars. It was holding that line and we broke it and we tested it again and now we're still seeing lower price. So we're still in a downtrend. That $1.20, if market price was able to hold $1.20, then yeah, we can say that we may have found the bottom we may have actually found the support area to where we can actually start lift off. But we broke that, we tested it, and now we still see price go lower. So I'm looking for the price in Matic to try to come down towards 94 cents first. And if we cannot sustain 94 cents, then I'm telling you already, we're gonna to try to come down here towards 72, 75 cents. Just be prepared for that. All right, so let me see how we look on the weekly time frame in Matic. You guys can see this is the weekly perspective. And the last four weeks, I mean, nothing but weakness. Every weekly price bar, we are closing lower than the previous one. Now, can we see a bounce? Can we see the market actually sustain and go higher? Yeah, we can. But don't take that as legitimate if the price cannot break up above $1.20. I'm telling you that right now. If price and Matic cannot get back up above $1.20, the trend is still in play, i.e., we're still going to go lower. Okay. So let me show you what's going on in the Matic on a two week time frame, seven days, nine hours left. Still seeing the weakness there. Uh, monthly time frame, three days, nine hours left on this monthly price bar. And it still shows us that the weakness is present, right? So let me go ahead and do this price prediction. Go ahead and let you all get your time back. Everyone in our community, let me show you where we're expecting this price to go. So yeah, we're still playing the weakness into the market in Matic, right? I told you $1.20 is that area of restriction okay now i'm gonna bring it up to a dollar 25 because i actually can see that the market may actually try to test that area too okay so on any bouts of strength that we get into the market in matic and we come up here to the dollar 25 if i still see weakness coming to market at this area i know that the play is still in, in tune it's still intact so the market weakness is still in play right so i'm playing the weakness here in matic like I said, the first area is going to be around 94 cents, right? That's the first area that will come through and TP out the market. TP simply means take the profit. Now, all the way down here to around 80 cents. Okay, that's where I'm looking for Matic to try to go in the long term. Now, long term, I'm not saying 5, 10, 15 years. That's ridiculous. I'm saying like, on a weekly basis, you know, weekly, three weeks, maybe a month time frame, we can see the market in Matic come all the way down to this particular level, right? We haven't found the bottom yet. Now, one thing I can see is that this market is going to try to test a dollar again and try to move higher from that point, right? So that's why I wanted to show you all where the market price has to break above in order for us to really see strength come through. And we're not necessarily seeing that yet. Okay, so let me run this back. All right, right there. 
So this is the area. This is what we're looking forward to into the marketing matic. So now you're part of our community, right? And since you're in our community, you need to learn how to do this too. You need to learn how to call the market, get in position and win and dominate. This is what we're seeing. So now it's your turn. Tell me what do you see on the price chart in Matic? At what point would you come through and quote unquote buy the dip? At what point would you expect the market price to stop going lower and sustain some support and start to go higher? What's your price? Put a price on it. Let us know. Make sure you maintain a profitability and as always, trade different.